Nina information Nina. Yes, you guys have so much information. We sit and we hang out and we chill on social media together as strangers, bonding over uh, 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 mutual things. And do you guys have personal information about people? How did Tuli P go from, oh, this picture is so cute, to abortion accusations, BBL? She's, ah! Ah! You guys better not be at her Lobola negotiations. She's not gonna get anything from the other family. In fact, it's gonna seem like the favor. When they love one like they're gonna like, just give her to us. You know what she's done. Just just give her to Bori. Hi, yo, I want to know information as well. Hey, 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 Nazin Taba, Nazin Taba. Nyan, I'm gonna go to Miami, 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 I am Sims and it's at the right Sims on Instagram, so please uh, follow your sister. Sana, yo, Kiri Sana, it is wild what is happening out in the streets, okay? So yesterday, um, there was an account, there's this account on Twitter that posts beautiful women from South Africa, right? And then they just say, and then people just like, oh, she's so gorgeous, she's so gorgeous. So yesterday, a picture of Utuli was posted in her gorgeous Gunji bikini, okay? Next thing, obviously, it's Twitter. It has to be dark, it has to be twisted, it has to be uh, very not demure, very not cutex. So then, Chris Excel was like, this is Tuli without Maporisa. This is Tuli P with Maporisa. And then it just went on from there. And then someone was like, okay. And let me tell you, in the first picture, so they're referring to the first picture. They say she looks skinny. That's where she was fresh, a virgin with no abortion. She deserved Lobola in that picture. In the second picture, she has done a BBL, two abortions, three morning after pills, four living on contraceptives, five damage to womb, six lost value on the dating market, seven biological clock. What? What? How do you know so much? Why are you the body police? Which qualification do you pick in a university to study so much about policing women and their bodies like this? You were there with her at Maristops when she was doing the fetus deleters. Were you there? Living on contraceptives. I went, I will beat you. I will beat you, family planning. Huh? Dating. How many exes of Tulipa Monos do you know? How many exes of yours do the problem about celebrities is that their lives are in public. The lives are in public. I remember Bonang being crucified for having four exes. At the time she was 36 and she had four exes. Do you know? People that are not on social media. People that are living life of social media or are not in the public. Do you know how many exes people have? Do you know? Do you? Hey! And also, the thing is, you see currently right now, in the overseas. Shits and gigs podcast, they are getting cancelled for the wild things they say. Okay? Okay, but right now they are being cancelled for going on Andrew Schwartz's podcast and laughing and cooning and <laughs> Right? You, you saw that going down. You know, Mina, I've never been like uh, a thingy, a watcher of shits and gigs. 
I used to just see the clips going around on social media, you know, and all I would see them do is laughing. But when you go to the comments, people are like, no, out of all the male podcasts, these guys are so good. Like, these guys are gentlemen. These guys are great. These guys don't bash women. These guys don't say wild things to get views about women because these red pill podcasts, all they do is just like bring women down, but not um, U James no no had you know. Khandi, it was always there. It was always underlying because apparently there was an episode in their podcast where Fu had like fully admitted to groping a girl in the club. She was like, this girl was so hot that I grabbed her bum bum zoom. And then um, the boyfriend tried to fight me and my friends. And I'm just like, it doesn't register the things that you say sometimes. You know, like, mm, oh, we're sure. You know, and apparently they've also admitted to putting their hands on women, okay? And they've always not said nice things about women, especially um chocolate uh, lovingly, deliciously hands. Apparently they've never like they don't say nice things about uh, women. Instead, women are bitches. You know, so for people that watch them avidly, they say oh, it's always been there. It's always been underlying. So this is not surprising to them. But for them to go on a podcast and laugh and like coon. And now they are the butt of the joke. Because the very same people they were laughing at on Andrew's podcast. Andrew and his friends are now laughing at shits and gigs. Andrew is now like dissecting the, the apology that um james had who had made and uh, he, he is like really 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 imagine like it is yeah <laughs> fight fight is a real thing and he is so do you see how we should go back we should go back because he's going through it right now look look how he practiced this let me i'm gonna pick my skin on my finger guys <laughs> Come on, no 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 so i need you to watch him look he bite his bottom lip like oh fuck, man there is no excuse Ooh. Um, oh, and oof. Fight or flight is a real thing. Like it is, yeah. Fight or flight is a real thing, and it's so not easy to say. But it, when you're in those situations, you you look at it through a lens of like, bro, if it was me, I promise you, I'll stand up, I'll kick them cameras down, yeah. I'll smack homeboy in the face, yeah. I'll say this, I'll do that. But imagine laughing and kicking with someone, and then you get cancelled, and they still stand firmly on what they said, and now they clown you. How about that? You see. You see that thing of discernment applied. What, man? What? It's a lot. Like it's a lot. It's a, it's, it's it's many. It's plenty. Yo, guys, I wanna one thing about social media and the internet scares me. He scares me. Oh, one day we are laughing with you. Next day, 